Hey guys, it's Vinny. Welcome back to Angry Birds Epic. So the second section just opened, so let's jump straight to that level. A little bit late to the party. So we're collecting balloons now, pig balloons in particular, so let's do this. Okay, we're fighting mech pigs with the certain retro level of the Sonic event. I'm gonna kill those guys because those are gonna target trap. And I hurt quite a bit. It's gonna heal for quite a bit. Oh, and we level up. First balloon. You get some bonus gold coins there. So I'm doing my best to not trying not to level up because that will actually increase the difficulty of the uh, the, the pigs themselves. And since I haven't rolled any new gear or new set items, it's going to make my birds run the power. So. We're gonna try avoid doing that, but we can't really do it because we're gonna be earning XP, so let's jump right into this level then. Isn't this the level from the, the Fortongo dungeon? The very first dungeon we do on Monday. This all seems too familiar to me. And I'm kind of nostalgia for some reason. So what do you guys think of this event so far? It seems to, you know, be doing a big retroactive flowback of all the previous events that's ever happened for some reason, so I could argue this is like the super villains event packed into a level in order to collect bombs in class. And that pig with the barbecue skewer. Final level. So what's this? Immunity. Effects not removable. Okay. Okay. This all seems rather arbitrary. I don't know if these levels generate a different realm or level by random, or is it just all fixed? Um, do we want to use the chili here? Uh, let's do it. Just adjusting the AC in the background. Yeah, this definitely feels like a... These levels were like a throwback to the dungeons. Oh, that poison actually hurts. 800. Oh wow, it's Whizpig, okay. And he deals a lot of damage. We could be in trouble here, guys. Hmm. I think we could well be in trouble. Oh, 
Oh dear. I feel like we have to use two chili cakes here. Oh my god, is that not enough? Oh boy. Hmm. He's gonna heal for a lot of that health as well. I think the best move might have been to use it. Use the um crap. I've already used it. Okay, well I've messed up here. Hopefully I don't get punished. Okay, I got punished. <laughs> Oh my god. Is this the first time I'm ever going to fail a campaign level? I should have come prepared. Wow. Uh, no, we're just going to redo this. Never mind. Hey guys, we're going to do this again, so I decided to reconfigure my comp, so we're going to go for a stun comp. Uh, this comp, it doesn't have much AoE, but we are relying heavily on the combos of Matilda's Nightmare set, as well as Frost Savage in general. Um, again, it does, like I mentioned at the beginning, it is going to lack AoE, so we may not be able to mow through the early waves, but this should be a good counter to Whispick, because he does primarily AoE damage, and we have Samurai to use the defensive formation. So hopefully this comp goes better than last time. So fingers crossed guys. Right. These guys do a lot of damage as well. Well, follow the plan. Hopefully we stun this guy. Uh, we're not lucky. Please get stunned. Thank you. Please get stunned, ghost pig. I hate you. Okay, we're gonna have to play defensive formation here. We need to kill him now. Shit, that's still a lot of damage. Okay, we're in deep trouble. <laughs> and he's back to full health as well. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. Because... No matter how much... No matter how much I try to stun him, he's just going to gain, gain all of his health back. Okay. I want to get stunned. I think we might have to do this again. Sorry about this, guys. Looks like my theory crafting didn't work out after all. Yeah, this is a bad comp. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, we're going to do this a third time. After some careful consideration, I thought Treasure Hunter could be it. Uh, the solution to defeating Whizpig, but I do think it's an absolute necessity because even though that 65% will reset his timer, I don't think it's the only thing you should rely on to win because if that 35% chance fails, then you're still going to take that hit and you'll just lose anyway. So we're just going to go with Skulkers here because he will buff the damage of my birds and we can pretty much clear out the rest of the pigs with the chili and then just stun him permanently with uh, the egg surprise from the blue. So that's our game plan for this time, so let's do it! I think we only need one. Like this round. Okay, let me do this. We'll have to pump it out again next turn. Okay. 
Okay, here we go. All these reserved chili cakes I farmed uh, in the first year of Angry Birds coming out. I had hundreds before, but now it's come down to this, so... Uh, let's see. Oh god, mistake. I need to do that first. Okay, I think one more set of chili cakes should do it. Pretty sad, I know. Oh, thank God. Thank God. And all, after all of that, really? We get a pittance of snoutlings from him. Alrighty guys, so that was the second part of this second anniversary event. Well, that was probably the toughest level to date, if anything. So I will see you guys in the next day. Until then, we've got to collect those pig balloons. So see you tomorrow.